Families are wondering how they're going to celebrate the holidays in the midst of a pandemic. It's really hard, especially for those staying in assisted living or long-term care facilities. Fox 2's Jasmine Huda reports on one organization that is helping families connect. Two words, plan now. Long-term care facilities are short-staffed and you're going to want to communicate sooner rather than later. Fortunately, there is an upcoming event to give you ideas on how you can come up with a plan to celebrate with your loved ones who are isolated during the pandemic. No doubt the holidays will take on a different look and feel in 2020. And for some older Americans, the experience will be especially tough. This year, more than ever, people who are isolated, people who are lonely are going to be more isolated and more lonely. That's why the local organization Voice wants to help. This Thursday, it's hosting a webinar designed to get you to get creative and get thinking just as facilities have been in connecting families throughout the pandemic. How do you think I'm going to be able to visit with Aunt Betty? You know, are we sticking with technology? You know, how is she feeling? Do we feel like it's a good idea if we are in a in a space where we're allowed to do indoor outdoor visitation? You know, is she feeling up to that? Is she comfortable with that? Or would she feel better about having a virtual visit? Whatever your plan is, the sooner the better. Long-term care facilities cannot act on a moment's notice. If we're talking about Thanksgiving, start thinking about that now, what you want to do. If you're talking about Hanukkah or Christmas or any of the other December winter holidays, if you're talking about a long-term care facility, start talking with the people who work there now because some facilities are going to be able to allow some things that others can't. The event is this Thursday afternoon from 1 to 2 p.m. It's a webinar called Creating Holiday Joy in the Shadow of a Pandemic. Registration is free, and we have an online link for you to sign up on fox2now.com and on the Fox 2 app. Now, keep in mind, different facilities are going to have different rules. Also, be willing to adapt if things change. You might need to adjust or even scrap your plans if new COVID-19 restrictions are issued. Jasmine Huda, Fox 2 News.